Well, this morning, <laughs> I'm breaking down five common sleeping problems you, you might not have heard of and the signs that you should look out for. I spoke to a certified sleep expert and the founder of Nap Bar Houston. What are the, the five most common sleep disorders that people struggle with? Most people don't know what insomnia is. And the, the biggest indicator is that you're waking up, you find yourself waking up two to three times a week at 3 a.m., 4 a.m. in the morning, and you can't understand why. You have daytime sleepiness, you're moody, uh, perhaps you have a, another onset of just depression. Typically, it means that you are suffering uh, with insomnia. Kalia, why are you talking about me? <laughs> I'm totally kidding. Being an insomniac, that, that's a, I feel like that's one of the more common ones. What are some of the other sleeping disorders that people might not know about? That most people don't know or are familiar with the restless leg syndrome. Uh, this basically is just when you are asleep or you are attempting to go to sleep, your legs go numb, they're throbbing, they're twitching. All right, so that's two. What are the last three? One is, is very common right now, and it's shift work, shift work disorder. And I say it's common because first responders, they are working shift work. All right, what are the, the last two? Last two. Most people haven't heard of this one, rapid eye movement behavior disorder. So this is usually associated with people who are vivid dreamers. If you are very vocal in your dreams, if you are somewhat violent in your dreams, if you're kick kicking, screaming, if you're doing anything with your hands, number five is narcolepsy. You know, a lot of people brag about, oh, I can fall asleep at the drop of a hat. Well, studies show that on average, it should take you 10 to 15 minutes to actually fall asleep. So if you were falling asleep within a minute or so, perhaps you are uh, experiencing narcolepsy. All right, so a lot of, lot of good information there. I'm gonna write up the web script really fast and we can get it online in case you missed any of that. All right, and tomorrow we're gonna break down three things you can do tonight to get a better night's sleep. I can't wait to read that one. <laughs> Sheeta, tell, tell us about, um, you know, people waking up today. Hopefully they got some good sleep, but they can they expect in their forecast?